This episode is brought to you by Kinch Gaming. Head on over to KinchGaming.com and use the offer code IDavidMagwire to get 5% off your next order of high quality Kinch Gaming controllers. What is up everybody? David Maguire here. Back with another episode of the Full Game Ice Walkthrough. Episode number 73. We got the... Was it the shell horn? Or the horn shell? Or whatever we needed to get from those crustaceans. It was pretty, or those Pisceans. It was pretty easy to get, um, actually. Two fights, I think? No, actually, I think we got it first try. So it, it wasn't difficult. So, that's good. Those will certainly make a difference. Time to strike while the iron is hot. The leader of the Lothians is named Glauco. He's hiding out in the Senate chamber. I've sent word along that we have a wizard who is going to trounce him. Eat that sea mold and wait for the effects to kick in. You eat the sea mold. It smells terrible and you feel a little sick. And now you feel a lot sick. Great! I can see from your face that you're ready to rumble! My men will sound the shell horns to announce you're on your way! You feel sick, and then you feel a lot sick. Yeah, maybe because I just ate some frickin' mold. <laughs> just, just saying. Is this a dungeon? Um, no. Yes. Maybe. I'm hoping we finish the, um... The crustacean empire today so it's not something we have to worry about in the future hopefully would be nice hey what's that smell i hear some puny little wizard from the surface is gonna defeat me let's see him try okay i'm up for it myth myth in this world is brutal i'm sure you guys are aware of how brutal myth is in this world it's bad but let's go ahead and get this out of the way um, so, I don't know if I'm going to do a straw poll. Oh, oh, it's two bosses. I didn't even realize that. Um, okay then. Yeah. Anyways, I don't know if I'm going to do a straw poll or if I'm just going to make the executive decision to just stop doing the Grand Theft Auto V walkthrough. We'll see. If you pay attention on Twitter and... Orthrisk. Okay, if you pay attention on Twitter and Discord and other social medias that you may uh, find my channel from, etc., I will do a poll. So, if I remember, I will do a poll, probably, maybe, I don't know, <laughs> we'll decide. Do a poll if I should do a poll, it doesn't matter. <laughs> I don't know how I word it. Because not many people watch the walkthrough anyways, so it's not like, do I try to make a video and announce the poll, or, or like... I don't know. But the pirate walker is happening regardless, or getting back on track regardless. Of whether you want it or not. You're getting it. Don't care. I don't want no lip. <laughs> I want to have some dinner tonight. And unfortunately, I want lobster. Don't tell our crustacean friends that I want lobster. I think they wouldn't like me. Can I cook you? <laughs> Forgive me for that. Which switchblade is that? Plus their tw 20, 30. Okay. Um. Start trapping. Can I eat you? That's the title I'm done. <laughs> Sorry about that. I think. I think that'll work out pretty good. Feeling, feeling kind of hungry. Kind of, kind of perished. Um. All right. I don't feel like I need that right now. Let's go ahead and faint him. I want to see if I can't get my 45 blade, and then Aurora, and then smack, and hopefully do. It's okay. Which I've done easily. I've proven that I could done easily. So we'll try. Don't know if you've noticed, uh, brought the bitrate up, which means longer upload times, because my upload speeds aren't higher yet, so, yeah. That's just something I had to, I decided I had to do, like it wasn't an option. So, I mean, we'll have to work with it. Hopefully in the near future, we will have somewhat faster speeds. Hopefully. 
Even if it's only like four instead of two. This two's pretty terrible. Um, pom pom. Yes, <laughs> thank you. You're about to get cooked. It's it's what I call the submission pass. Or not. Okay. I don't draw. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we there. There it is. <laughs> I was like, it's gotta be in here. It was gonna make me cry. Another submission pass. If I would have fizzled again, it would have been hashtag Illuminati confirmed. <laughs> do, do, do. Um, what else was I gonna say? I didn't kill. Um, I don't think there's much, much else to say, to be honest. Thought I had a faint on my dude. Stun immune and stunned. So, not what I thought I was gonna do. I mean, I could just blizz. But the thing is, is I don't think I'm gonna kill. So I'm kind of upset about that, to be honest with you. I'll work with what I got, but I'm upset about it. Need to heal if I don't kill with this next hit that I'm gonna go ahead and throw out before this aura expires. Hopefully, uh, we get a crit. Even though I only have like an 11% chance. Hope for it, anyways, I guess. I mean, he did waste all his pips first round. But now we have to worry about that. Um. That's bad. Oh, that's not as bad as I thought it'd be. Oh, yeah, I have to heal. So I'm gonna see if I can't get the tower shield, because I'm not killing. Because I'm not criticaling with an 11% chance. So. Um, man, that didn't kill. Which is exactly what I thought would happen. I did grab that tower shield, so we're gonna go ahead and throw that on. Hopefully, we don't die today. Um, that would be bad. Minus 50%. Alright, this should kill. No, actually... Oh yeah, this, and then follow up a wand on that guy, I guess. I should be fine. Actually, maybe not. Because that basically hits me twice. He's basically pulling out peeve strats. Um, it's gonna cut close. It's gonna cut very, very close. Yeah. Okay. Crit, crit, crit. <laughs> Basically. <laughs> um, I've been thinking of making a new title in my Discord server. Um, for specific groups. That's really bad. Um, let's process that for a minute. That could possibly be my death here in like five minutes. And if it is, um, but it'll be a special group of people, um, with the title Reinforcements. So, it'll be, because right now we have, what ranks do we have? We have, I'm a genius, great value mayo, mayo, and then mods and admins. Um, the first two ranks, I'm a genius and great value mayo, are kind of <laughs> meme ranks. But, um, but, um, I'm gonna use that in forever. But, um, I wanna add a new rank on top of that, just reinforcements, which won't have any special, like, what we called mod privileges. It would just be a title, kinda like how I'm a genius and great value now. Mayo are just titles. Right? Because if I go. Server settings rules. If I go to I'm a genius. Like, they have no, like, they have no abilities, like, they're just, um... Oh, you got the wrong guy! I was set up by the Shadow Weavers! They was calling the shots! I was just a patsy! 
Okay. Thurston Plunkett. Okay, well... We're moving in the right direction. I feel like this is going a bit faster than I thought it was. There's no way we're done yet. That'd be crazy. But, um, what was I up to? Oh, server settings on Discord. But basically the reinforcements title would just be people who I let add me. And when they're on Discord, like, if I need help, um, I can just, like, kind of like how there's an at everyone, I can just be like, at reinforcements. Need some help, <laughs> basically. <laughs> and just, like, see if anyone's available. So. That's how it'd go down. That's how I'd like to do it. Um, for times I can't get a hold of, basically, one of my friends. <laughs> so if I can't get old Mark or Brittany or something, I can just hashtag reinforcements or at reinforcements or whatever. Like, I need help. <laughs> and we'll see how that works. Um, another thing I need to do is... I'm gonna go through all these, uh, basically. And see, basically, who still plays. And I'm just gonna start, um... Every episode or every other episode giving out a TFC at the end and seeing how that works but that'll be once we start doing a video per day well maybe what I'll do is I'll put it in descriptions I don't know so the shadow weavers were responsible it's as I expected the entrance to the solarium is within the Barbican the capital of the crustacean empire the secret to the astral school of sun magic is within the solarium and must be kept from more God at all costs if the Lothians are working with the Shadow Weavers, that means that Morganth can't be far behind them. You must go to the Solarium and recover the Son of Celestia before she takes it for herself. The Crustaceans haven't let me enter the Barbican. Maybe Nestor will tell you how to get in and pass the Pisceans. So basically, they're going to make us do more work for them so that they can take advantage of us, basically. Okay. I don't know if you heard that or not, but it was loud. It's a Neuster. The Barbican has been taken by the Piscean guards when they seized control of our government. Now we are lucked out! If you want to find a way in, you'll have to find out how. Maybe the Piscians will tell you. I'm gonna scream. Okay. Um. Yeah, that's pain. Four. I'll be back. Alrighty, so we did that fight, and it led us into another fight, and now we have to talk to Lieutenant is it Defoe here in the Crustacean Empire. So let's see what he has to say. Who be ye, and how'd you get through me, men? From the looks of you, you're seeking a way into the Barbican, am I right? I am Lieutenant Defoe of the good ship Calypso, a pirate vessel sunk in times ago within these very waters. We're pleased to help you get where you needs to be if you can lend us a hand in return. The Poissians and their lackeys, the Lothians, have been giving us a wee spot of trouble as of late. Could you gather for us the power motes from some downstellar protectors? We have need of them. All right. Um, I guess, four. I mean, that's not too bad. And then there's one right here, too, so, wooden chest. Um, how much gold do we get in that? 117? That's not, that's not too bad. But there's one right there, so. I don't think it should be too hard to find. I could be wrong. Light of the spiral. Yeah, there's none over here. And I don't know if that's something we have to do right there. Kinda hope not. <laughs> The less fights, the better, is, uh, what I've learned from my personal experience, that is. That is, uh, when we have to fight Calypso, basically. Here's another down stellar protector. So basically, they're gonna take advantage of these things to defend themselves against some Lothians. And some Piscians. I don't know. 
Either way, it's not the big deal. Wow, you have to walk around the sign piles. Alright, oh, Dan. Isn't that a common occurrence? Yes. Yes, it is. Um, it's your average cheat. Whoa, help us. Give us luck for the rest of the rest of the walk, right? <laughs> Probably not, but still. It's a thought. Another wooden chest. I want. Level 75 soon. Um, so we're moving on up. Making our way slowly uh, to Safaria. That's gonna be fun. So I got the thumbnail made for the pirate walkthrough. The pirate walkthrough will probably, some of it might even be uploaded before this is, I don't know, we'll see. Ah, just what the doctor ordered. These power modes will make fine cannonballs for when it comes to broadsides. When we first were stranded down here, the crustaceans struck deep into our hearts. They took our treasure! They claim they'd destroy our gold if we made a move on it, so we're stymied. It's been peaceful ever since. But from the sound of things, now they're in need of help from the crew of the Calypso. If we can get our treasure back from the crustaceans, we'll happily lend our swords to their cause. X marks the spot. If this takes me to the senator, that'd be great. <laughs> no. Takes me back to Newster. Um, we'll just take us to the Senate. So the Senator can help them. I didn't think we'd have to talk to him again, to be honest, but you think something once and you'll probably be wrong. And that's usually how it is in Woods. Or in any game for that matter. So, basically. Do -do -do. Um, someone said make videos for Smite, <laughs> and I'm not gonna do that, because it's, it's not like gameplay gameplay that's easily recorded, I don't know, if that makes sense. It's better for streaming, and having a fun time. Maybe I'm wrong, probably wrong, but, you know. The treasure of the Calypso? Oh my, the Lothians took that a while ago. Of course they did. They hid it somewhere and quartered the map that showed where it was buried. Did you say quartered? Does that mean four? Each of the pieces was given to a trusted Lothian. If you defeated them, you might find the four quarters of the map. I don't mean to trouble you further, but all right, he's not far from here. No. Can you find him and lend a helping claw? Anything to quiet him. So, oh. It's just a feat and collect four from basically regular anglers, so... That's not actually as bad as I thought it could be. I was like, does that mean four bosses? No, it doesn't. So, yeah, we'll be back with that. Did I ever tell you how much I hated Celestia? It's a lot. <laughs> um, I had to talk to the lieutenant again. We're finishing up Crustacean Empire this episode, even if it takes four hours. I don't care. You found where the treasure is hid? It's not ideal, but it's a sight better than empty hands. I can make hide nor hair of this map without a compass. Can you help find our compass from where it was taken? If you say defeat and collect... We've heard tell that a Piscean commander named Acastus Hexfin had it in his keeping. Okay. He patrols the Barbican. The Terrace, the Mezzanine, and the Concourse are his usual haunts. So we have to go find him, basically. Man is a bit low. Um, so yeah. Uh, we're gonna go find this dude. I don't wanna get hit by these sea booters. I hate it. I hate to fight these. Um, yeah, that was no fun. I don't, I'm not a fan of the sea booters. I'm gonna be honest with you. I would, mainly because they're ice, but I would take those Pisceans over the sea booters. Let's be honest. Let's be real. But, um, I think I made a mistake. Um, okay. <laughs> that could have been bad. I just want to finish this damn world, to be honest. Trying to get a hold of Muark Mark to record episode 74. So I just want to finish this damn world. 
If I can start getting into Safaria and questing Safaria, that would be great. No sign of a Castus Hexfin here. Oh, we have to find him. Okay. All the more fun. <laughs> Isn't that beautiful? Hopefully, this isn't too terrible. But he did give us a list of three places, and something tells me we're going to be going to all three places. And are you kidding me? I hate these things. Um, he better be here so I don't have to walk through these guards. A Castus Hexfin isn't here either. I quit. <laughs> Alright, well. He's got to be in this next place, because he only gave me three places, so if he's not here, I'm deleting. <laughs> not serious, but... No sign of a Castus Hexfin here. What? I don't find that funny. If he's not in here, I'm taking all of his loot. Did those waterlogged old buccaneers send you after their compass? I'll send you back where you came from. Oh my god. And all three are ice. Um. Oh my gosh, guys. I am oh, oh my gosh. So, so sorry. Okay, so this fight ended up taking me... Legitimately, it took me 20 freaking minutes to do this fight. So I decided... It was going to be a hell of a lot more convenient if I just went ahead and put it into Premiere and clipped it up and instead of having it be 20 minutes, bringing it down to about 7 minutes by setting the speed to about 300%. So hopefully this makes the episode a little bit more bearable and brings the total time down a little bit more as it is right now. In the later later in the episode, I will keep a little bit more struggle factor, uh, as you'll see is going on, but uh, as of right now, this took 20 minutes. It might be one of the longest, single longest fights I've ever had to uh, deal with in the entire walk, so it's really, really crazy. So I went and I just, I don't know, I went and found like some no copyright sounds that didn't sound like crap, because I didn't know what to talk about for seven minutes, so. Uh, yeah, one of the things I think I mentioned in this clip is something about uh, deciding on doing like more scripted content and I think that's something you might see is a lot more scripted content where like I might record it but I might not record myself and might just put it in there later and that's something that I will look into and decide if that's something I want to do uh, going on but yeah I'm hoping that this isn't too terrible and that I didn't make you guys like cringe too much by speeding this up but uh, it's a long episode as it is already, so I figured if I can bring it down, try to uh, not have this super long ass episode, I figured that's where I wanted to be compared to where I am now. But yeah, guys, I do apologize if you will. <coughs> Excuse me, if you want, you can just skip past this fight. I completely understand, um, and I don't blame you at all. Um, so if you want to do that, go ahead and do that. Um, yeah, thanks. Peace. Wait, this, the episode isn't over. Just, just me talking for now is over. Yeah. <laughs> By the way, finally killed. Praise. That took 
No joke, that took 20 minutes. You got our compass back! It's a little bent and dinged up, but it still points true. While you were away, I had a word with our captain, Queen Calypso. She shares the name of the ship. <laughs> she said she'll help you, but only if you can prove your mettle in battle. Of course. That means you must cross swords, or wands, or what have you, with Queen Calypso herself. She's a wily one, and won't be an easy mark, so best of luck to you. She awaits you at the bow of the ship. <laughs> So hopefully this fight isn't as ridiculous as the last one, because, oh my lord, um, that's bad, really, really bad, how long that took, terrible. This is cool, let's take a second to recognize how cool this is. Um, Queen Calypso, the spell, juicing it, so here's their sunken ship basically. Kind of a cool little cave that they kind of had to come out of when they landed, but I think that's just because of the way the Empire itself is, uh, yeah. I am Queen Calypso. My ship and soul are intertwined and I rule these seas. Who are you to challenge me in my place of power? I thought she was a friend and just wanted to battle, not that she wanted to straight up kill me. I don't believe she cheats, um, but she does have 7, 7k, which the only thing I'm not a fan of is that sea booter, let's be honest. Ice has not been a friend to me this up at all. It's been anything but. But I think, I think we'll overcome it. I think, I think we'll learn from our trials may have, basically. But we'll see. Ho, oh, hey, do do do, do do do. Um, I don't have any new pips, so I'll use that. I don't want to waste these power pips. She fizzled. I believe this Queen Calypso fight is like, basically, the end of this area, if I'm correct. Like, I think we're almost done with the Crustacean Empire. And if not, well, yeah. If not, I'm struggling because that's insane. But I don't think anyone quite understands know why I did that. Maybe we'll try something different. Who knows? If I do, I'll prism again, and then I'll faint after I do the hit. So I want to hit and then have faint hand, basically. I don't have it in hand yet, so I'm not going to do it. And I'm going to want to prism again. Well, I don't have to, but I want to. Doo -doo. Okay, fine. Let's go. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> we haven't used it very often, so I think juicing it will not be a problem. Bum, bum, bum. Wow. I'm losing myself today, team. We don't do wrong. What I'll do... Three. That's fine. What I'll do is I'll faint now. Which is fine. And then just hit with something else. Not that the sea booter cares what he gets hit with, to be honest. Please. There. 
so we don't have a full full hand. That's insane. Total episode length will be brought down from what I think it will be right now, but we're, we're looking at an hour special probably, which we haven't done in a while. It's what I call an unintentional hour special, of course. Maybe I do have a couple of them. I don't know. I'll definitely speed this section up probably too. Maybe. No, I don't think so. I think this battle is pretty clean. Um, it's the battles that take 30 hits that aren't so fun, I would have to say. But don't worry, this episode at length will be brought down by about 20 minutes. And see, she trapped herself in the process. He's gonna be a problem. In fact, I think that one thing might be good now. Because at least then I'll still kill. Yeah. Here it is. <laughs> Fizzle? Nope. I thought it was for a second, but wrong. Good. She'll actually have two of those that can be used by one of them by the thing, so... Turns out pretty well. Like I said, haven't had to juice this before, so... Don't have a faint in hand, but still gonna do a lot. Quite a bit. In fact, the faint is still on her. Strange. How much I do? 328, not too bad. Yeah, now I remember. A faint and the, uh one you put on yourself when you do faint, those traps don't stack. Now that I remember. Yeah, they don't stack. I'm gonna do this so it dies. But that did 1300. I mean, she did herself a favor by doing that, to be honest. Blizzard? Not bad, not bad at all. Um, what was I going to say? I've been thinking about doing more of a more scripted type content. Thinking, that is. Uh, thinking and doing are two different things, of course, but thinking about more scripted content as an idea is. He's dead, and hopefully she is too. We'll see. Um, gonna be buying a camera soon. I know a lot of people have requested it for my streams, uh, that they wanted to see my ugly ass face. Don't know why, but it's what you guys have requested, so I guess if that's what you want, I'll give it to you. <laughs> How much health does she have? Oh, <laughs> pass. <laughs> Basically. Much easier, and okay. Help me out here. I am taken aback at your skill with magic. You have won my respect. United, we are unassailable. For long years, the crustaceans feared our intervention. Our time has come! You provided Lieutenant Tufo with a treasure map. It points at the crustaceans' treasury. Only the Lothians would think to hide our treasure back in the treasury from whence they took it. Journey now to the treasury and recover our treasure. If it is restored, we will lend you our blades. Sounds good to me. I forgot what this does. So, you wish to test your metal against me once more? Oh. You can resummon her. Hopefully we don't have to fight her again when the time comes. But... If it does, we will not be doing that. <laughs> we'll level this up. Because we're finishing the Empire. No questions. I need health. So. Proceeds to get pulled by a sea booter in the process. Let's not. So this is what this is over here. This is the treasury. Huh. So I don't have to fight nothing, which is like... 
I don't like the fact that I am afraid I'm gonna have to fight her again. Um, crossing my fingers and my toes. Cause that was no fun. I wish it was just Defoe we had to talk to and not Queen Clipso, but... We have to fight her, we have to fight her, and crossing my fingers and toes that it's a no, that I don't have to fight her. But I did do the mistake by resummoning her, so maybe I will have to fight her. Rip. Bum, ba, bum, bum. I want to know why that captain is a girl. <laughs> She's not here, but. Yeah. We have longed for your return. We counted the minutes you were away from us. Oh, gleaming treasure. It is good to see you as well, wizard. Oh. I have a gift for you. One that will take you further than our mere blades. The key to the Barbican. Good. We stole one long ago and hid it amidst our gold. It is the greatest of fortune the Lothians did not find it. Yeah, it is. The Piscians are led by a vicious tyrant named Praetor Mako. He skulks in the Barbican far from harm. With this key, you can enter the Barbican and deal a death blow to the Piscean uprising. Let's mark a deal. <laughs> I'm done. And I think that's where things start to get a little bit juicy. So, happy about that. Bum bum bum. Bum bum bum. Bum bum bum. But yeah, we'll go to the Barbican in the Crustacean Empire. And... Here we go. Is it this direction right here? Cool. Um, so it's what this door is right here that I was like, I hope this isn't anything I need to go into. Well, it is. It's something I need to go into. I don't believe, look how tiny that door is. How did any sharks get through that door? The scent of wizardry is on the current. Soon there will be blood in the water. You make me laugh. You make me laugh so hardcore. Do 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 do. So 6800, not as near as bad as what we had to put up with before. Do do. Boom. And no ice at all. <laughs> you don't understand how relieving it is to not have to deal with ice. Ice is so terrible. Oh yeah. Okay. Bum bum. So, I mean, we'll just need to feign him. Maybe trap him as well, but really we just need to see if we can double and or triple play. So as long as we don't need to heal, that won't be a problem. If we need to heal, it, it might become a problem. So look out for that spice. 35, 35, 35. It's your boy. Skinny five. <laughs> I don't know. Don't ask. Don't ask and you don't have to find out. Is, is that is that how is that how it goes? Don't ask and you don't have to find out, or you don't wanna find out, so don't ask? I don't know. What well, whatever. Super long episode. Will it reach the two hour? God, I hope not. <laughs> um, if it does, I'm so, so sorry. <laughs> You'll have a movie to watch. Be like watching the Titanic. <laughs> Except better. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Is it better than the Titanic? No. <laughs> And I think we decided that the title is going to be Can I Eat You? <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Sorry, really kind of juicy today, let's be honest. Alright, 35. And. Okay. 
fuck. Okay. Um. I got this. We'll kill next. Not a big deal. So much easier than that ice boss that took 20 minutes. Okay. I forgot about that. I should still be able to kill, to be honest. Triple blade? Um. Alright. Look at all those enchants we just drew. Don't have to worry about that for a little while, I guess. Bum, bum, bum. Yeah, I forgot that that's a life and a death dispel. I struggled in this world on my death. <laughs> I hated this world with a slimy passion. I gotta have a hit in here. Okay. Maybe I don't have a hit in there. I gotta repack my deck sometime. Not a big deal though. Should still kill to be honest. Or get very, very close. I think we're at the point where... Fizzle mid spell please. All right, um, yeah, that's a shrug. I hope I kill you. That's ridiculous. That is actually ridiculous. I'm doing this just to kill him. That's ridiculous. That is the stupidest thing that has ever happened to me in this entire game. That's a lie. It's an example of some of the stupidest things that have ever happened to me in this entire game. Here's where the questions come in. David, why do you even play Wiz? Well, I don't know. <laughs> sometimes, I don't know. Sometimes I like the game. And sometimes I just don't know. Is that fair enough? Hopefully, because you're not getting a better answer than that. <laughs> Did he just hit me? Did he just smack me? Can I, like, report him now? Can I, like, deport him now? <laughs> um... Oh, don't want that. Almost caught myself doing that. That might not have been very good. Dude. Bum, 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 bum. Hopefully I can draw a hit. If not, well... Too bad, I guess. For me, it's gonna suck. But in general, it's just too bad, I guess. No, I'm hitting with something. Watch me draw like an ice bird. No. <laughs> Honestly, where are my hits? Up for another 20 minute battle, folks. <laughs> Please. Feels like King's Isle's giving me the finger. Really feels like I'm getting the finger. I know drawing ain't gonna do him any good. Can't be as easy as the Quipso fight, huh? 
Out of curiosity, what does more? Oh, never mind. Can't find out. <laughs> I was just curious. I wanted to know what was gonna do more. Wasn't permitted to find out, I guess. Plus 40, but yeah, he's dead. I think I won't I won't shorten that fight now. Wait, what? Yeah, I'm not gonna shorten this fight down just for the struggle factor. Um because you guys didn't get the struggle factor in the first fight. And we gotta have a little bit of struggle factor in each episode. Even though I don't want struggle factor, we still get struggle factor. That's just the way it is. Um, makes me considering... want to farm more. Like, more Mount Olympus, or not more Mount Olympus. Jeez, no, more, uh... Waterworks or House of Skills farming. I think I want the rope, not skills. On his defeat, Praetor Mako drops a piece of stone embossed with the sun. A piece of the Solarium Portal Stone. Okay. The good news is... The real, real good news is that we're done with this area. Like, we're straight up just done with the Crustacean Empire. That's the good news. The bad news is that we're not done with this darn planet. So, yeah. And we still have to talk to Plunkin, which I find interesting. He's the person that we came to find in Celestia in the first place, believe it or not. So, for those of you who have forgotten, like, why did we even come to Celestia? Well, because of him. Because of these darn Marleybonians who think they can start something. Because they're good at it. But I say no more. I say we take away their ability to travel, and the Marleybonians won't be a problem anymore. <laughs> Plunkett, help. By Jove, you've got it! After all the searching and scrambling for pieces of the portal, you now have access to the Solarium itself. Well, don't let me stop you. Get back to Celestia Base Camp and be on your way. Get the fuck away from me. No, <laughs> I don't want to do your side quest. <laughs> I don't know if you're aware of this, but I don't like your expedition team. And we're leveling. <laughs> the portal is finally complete. I'm gonna talk to Edith. Edith, I'm excited to get out of this world. <laughs> This planet is terrible. I think we should lock it down. You got the Solarium Stone repaired? I can't believe it! Ready yourself. The Solarium contains power beyond your imagining. If you can recover the Sun of Celestia, you can unlock the secrets of the Celestian Sun magic. Okay. According to Plunkett, the Sun of Celestia is in a place called the Chancel. It may be guarded, though, so be careful. All right. So this is where episode number 73 ends. Next episode, uh, cleaning up shop and basically finishing up Celestia. Uh, honestly, this like this clip in itself could have been a whole episode. 48 minutes. So I just need to process that and process how long this episode is. So if you made it this far, you're a freaking G. Um, and I appreciate it if you subscribe if you haven't already. Hit notifications. Uh, follow me on social media, links in the description below. Stay safe and peace out.